Hey there, welcome to Motion, the ultimate tool to supercharge your productivity and take control of your schedule like a pro. In this quick guide, we'll set you up for success by connecting your calendars, customizing your auto schedule settings, and defining your own schedules. Are you ready to get started? All right, let's dive in. First things first, let's connect your calendar. This is the most important step in Motion because Motion needs to know when you're free or busy so it can schedule your tasks effectively. Here's how to do it. Click on the settings button in Motion. Navigate to the calendar section under general settings. In accounts, you can choose which kind of account you want to add. It could be a Google Calendar, Outlook Calendar, or iCloud Calendar. Once you click one of these, you can follow the prompts and link your calendar to Motion. Now we have to select your main calendar. Your main calendar is where Motion will create all your tasks and your events by default. You can do that here by clicking on Edit and selecting which of the calendars will be your main calendar. Now let's talk about the My Calendars section. Here. These calendars are used by Motion's algorithm to figure out when you are busy or free. So you want to add all calendars that represent how you spend your time under my calendars. You do not want to accidentally add someone else's calendar under my calendars section. Great job. Now with your calendars connected, let's move on to auto scheduling settings. These settings determine how most settings determine how motion schedules tasks on your calendar. So it's crucial to get them just right. Here's how we're going to do it. First, let's click on settings and let's click on auto scheduling under general. You'll see a few options. Option one is only show motion tasks on the motion calendar. We highly recommend you do this. By making motion your primary calendar, you have all your tasks and events in one place, no juggling required. Option two is show motion on your external calendar, but keep tasks as free. This will allow people to see your tasks and yourself to see your tasks on your external Google Calendar, for example, but you don't want them to block time so others can schedule meetings with you. Option three, is show tasks on your external calendar and mark tasks at risk of missing deadlines as busy event. This is super handy if you frequently book meetings with other people or other people frequently book meetings with you. It helps protect time in your calendar for critical tasks. Next up, decide if you want others to see your tasks names if they have visibility into your calendar. If privacy is a concern, you might want to keep this up. But if you're cool with your coworkers or managers seeing what you're working on, go ahead and turn it on. Lastly, you can set up your break preferences. Decide how often you want to take breaks and how long they should be. Motion will automatically schedule them to keep you refreshed through the day. With that, you're all set with auto schedule. Now let's talk about custom schedules. This feature lets you specify exactly when certain tasks should be scheduled, like blocking out morning hours for creative work or even in hours for personal projects. Here's how to create a custom schedule. Let's go to settings and select schedule. Now click on new schedule. You can define your desired schedule by selecting the dates and times. For example, imagine you're a growth marketer by day, but you own an ice cream shop by night. That's a wild combo, right? You might want to keep those worlds separate. For your ice cream shop tasks, you might want to create a schedule Monday through Friday, 5 to 8 p.m. You can do so by dragging, and then you can click on Copy, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and apply that schedule to the rest of the week. We're going to name it Ice Cream Shop. And we're going to click Save. And just like that, we have an ice cream shop schedule. Now, when you create a task related to your side hustle, you can select that schedule so that task is scheduled at that time. For example, I'm gonna click here to create a new task and you can see that I can pick a schedule, ice cream shop, so that that task gets scheduled with that time in mind. This feature is useful so that you can have a little bit more control over when Motion schedules tasks for you. You can also break down your personal task, your work tasks, your side hustle, your school, or anything else that you might wanna work in a specific time during the day. Awesome, so now you've connected your calendars, you set up auto scheduling, and you've defined custom schedules. With these steps, Motion is tailored fit to your life now, ensuring you work smarter and not harder. Ready to take on the world with your newfound productivity powers? I thought so. All right, happy scheduling. Bye-bye.